So previously we created our content within AutoCAD, within Civil. Um, we had our solid, we had our line, we had our connection point. We exported that out to a dot, dot content file. So I'm going to open up the content catalog editor. Um, it's just found under your all of your programs. Uh, what the pressure pipe system is coming from is a SQLite database. So I'm going to open up that database. If I go to open catalog, um, you can come and you can see where this one's at. So it's buried pretty deep down in there. Um, the three different catalogs, we got the flange, mechanical, and push-on. I'm just going to go into the push-on and, and edit that one. So I'm going to open this SQL, um, SQLite database. It's going to have all that information here um, for the parts in there. So if I want to add a part to it, um, we want to import part. Okay. I can do it here. I can right-click on this and go to import part. Um, get rid of this hydrant. So if I right-click on hydrant and go to import part, it's going to look for a dot to content file, the ones we just exported out. Um, if I import it from a content file, it's going to be like the hydrant, the valve, etc. If I do it without a content file, this is how you create large diameter pipes um, if you need to add pipe sizes into uh, those parts lists. Uh, so import with the content file is going to get you your individual parts, your valves, your appurtenances, things like that. Without a content file, again, just going to be a pipe. So I'm going to go to that content file. I'll just put this on my desktop. This is where I'm going to access the, uh, the hydrant and that test valve that we did. So I'm going to go to hydrant. I'm going to hit open. And this is just a quick wizard here. I'm going to hit next. Industry type, water, part type is going to be a hydrant. Part family, you know, we could put whatever type of part family we wanted into, into this, having multiple part families. I'm going to keep it simple. I'm just going to do a hydrant. Hit next. Model properties. Okay. ID type. So these first four are required. Everything else is up to you. You know, you can put in whatever information you want, but the first four are required. So I'm going to go ID type. Um, I'm just going to go uh, a yard hydrant on this one. ID material. Cast iron. Just picking some things. Description in here, I could you know be a little bit more um, uh, graphic with my descriptions here if I wanted to. I'm just going to again keep it simple. Hydrant. Hit next. Um, this is going to read the con the uh, connection points. So we already have one on there, so it just reads the one. When we do the valve, it's going to read the two. So a little bit of information about the connection points. I'm just going to hit finish. Okay. So it's added that hydrant in there. Uh, I'm going to do the same thing for that valve that we created. So I'm going to right click here. I'm going to go to import part. Import from a content file. This one's going to be my valve. Just hit next here. Water part type, we're going to do valve. Part family name. Those different families that are already there. Again, you could create your own family right here. I'm just going to throw it in this 200 PSI only. And hit next. Material properties, ID type. Knows it's a valve, so what type of valve? Um, just going to pick one, pick a random anything. ID material. Bunch of different options here. I'm just going to go ductile iron. Description, again, I could name the size of this valve if I wanted to. So, you know, if I did 12 inch ductile iron valve, something. So I hit next here, connection points. So there's the two connection points. Um, in here, I could put in the outer diameter, nominal diameter, you know, whatever I wanted to type in here. The type, whether it's push on, mechanical, things like that, that I can add in here bunch of other information. Okay, I'm just going to leave it all defaulted and then hit finish. Okay. So once that's done, once I add my hydrant, once I add my valve, I can save this. And again, I'm in the push on um, SQLite database. I'm just going to save this. Then we're going to go into our parts list back into Civil 
we're going to add this to our parts list, and we're going to do a, just a quick layout of that uh, that hydrant, including that valve.